Uh, if I were omnipotent for a day, I'd make myself omnipotent forever. Come on, Ross, you, me, Joey, Ice Guys Night Out. Come on, what do you say, big guy, huh? 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 What are you doing? I have no idea. <laughs> hockey! Hockey! hockey. 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 Oh, come on, Dora, don't be mad. I know we both said some things we didn't mean, but that doesn't mean we still don't love each other. You know, I, I feel like I've lost her. Bah! Remember the moonlight coming in through the open window and her face in the most incredible glow. Yes, the moon, the glow, the magical feeling. You did this part. Could I get some painkillers over here, please? Man, can you believe he's only had sex with one woman? I think it's great. You know, it's sweet. It's romantic. Really? No, are you kidding? The guy's a freak. I just... Hello. Oh, uh, Rachel, it's the Visa card people. Oh, okay. Will you take my place? All right. Yes, this is Rachel. So, Saturday night, the big night, date night, Saturday night, Saturday night. <laughs> no plans, huh? Not a one. Oh, it was horrible. He called me young lady. Ooh, I hate when my father calls me that. <laughs> well, I'm going to get another espresso. Uh, more latte? No. <laughs> No, I, I'm I'm still working on mine. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> Here's the thing, Janice. You know, I mean, it's like we're different. You know, I'm like the bing, bing, bing. You're like the boom, boom, boom. Ow! Oh, my God! Ow! I'm so sorry. Ow! Are you okay? Ow! Um, it's just my lens. It's my lens. Um, uh, I'll be right back. Um. I hit her in the eye. I hit her in the eye. This is the worst breakup in the history of the world. Oh my god. Okay. How many of those have you had? Oh, I don't know. A million? Oh. Hey, where's Chandler? Oh, he needed some time to grieve. I'm free! I'm free! There's a beautiful woman at eight, nine, ten o'clock. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, she's amazing. She makes the women I dream about look like short, fat, bald men. <laughs> well, go over to her. She's not with anyone. Oh, yeah, right. And what would my opening line be? Excuse me. <laughs> oh, come on, she's a person. You can do it. Oh, please, could she be more out of my league? Ross, back me up here. He can never get a woman like that in a million years. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh, but you know, you always see these really beautiful women with these really nothing guys. You could be one of those guys. <laughs> you could do that. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Yes, absolutely. Oh, God, I can't believe I'm even considering this. I'm very, very aware of my tongue. Come on, come on. Right, here it goes. Yes? Hi. Um, <clears throat> okay, next word would be uh, Chandler. <laughs> Chandler is my name, and uh, <clears throat> hi. <clears throat> yes, you said that. Yes, yes, I did, but what I didn't say was what I was about to say. What I wanted to say was, uh, would you like to go out with me sometime? Thank you. Good night. <laughs> oh, so, so you're divorced? No. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. So you're widowed, hopefully. You know how in a relationship you have these key moments that you know you'll remember for the rest of your life? Well, every single second is like that with Aurora. <laughs> oh, great. This is just... <laughs> oh, my God. I am trapped in an ATM vestibule with Jill Goodacre. Is it a vestibule? Maybe it's an atrium. Oh, yeah, that is the part to focus on, you idiot. No, I'm not alone. I don't know, some guy. Oh, some guy. I am some guy. 
Hey, Jill, I saw you with some guy last night. Yes, he was some guy. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. It's been 14 and a half minutes and you still have not said one word. Oh, God, do something. Just make contact. Smile. No, if Jill Goodacre offers you gum, you take it. If she offers you mangled animal carcass, you take it. <laughs> you know, on second thought, gum would be perfection. <laughs> gum would be perfection? Gum would be perfection. Could have said gum would be nice, could have said I'll have a stick, but no, 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 no. For me, gum is perfection. <laughs> I loathe myself. Okay, let's try it. No, you gotta whip it. <laughs> Um, I'm account number 71434457, and uh, I don't know if you got any of that, but I would really like a copy of the tape. Question. You're not dating anybody, are you? Because I met somebody who would be perfect for you. Uh, you see, perfect might be a problem. Had you said codependent or self-destructive. <laughs> but Janice, that, that was like the worst breakup in history. I'm not saying it was a good idea. I'm saying I snapped. There you are. But you found me. Here, Ross, take our picture. Smile, you're on Janice's camera. <laughs> kill, kill me now. I love babies with their little baby shoes and their little baby toes. And their little... <laughs> okay, you're gonna have to stop that forever. Seems as though that maybe you have intimacy issues, you know, that you use your humor as a way of keeping people at a distance. Huh. Why can't you stop staring at my breasts? What? What? She's new? Uh, Joey's having an embolism. But I'd go for a nip, you know. Come on, I'll show you to my room. That sounds so weird when it's not followed by no thanks, it's late. I've been thinking, you know, about how I'm always seeing girls on top of girls. Are they end to end or tall like pancakes? Go with the egg, my friend. <laughs> go, 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 go. Think it'll work? No way, it's suicide. The man's got an egg. How do I look? Oh, um, I don't care. <laughs> okay, I'm making a break for it. I'm going out the window. I brought you something. Is it loaded? So, it's a typical day at work. I'm in putting my numbers, and Big Al calls me into his office and tells me he wants to make me processing supervisor. That is great! Oh my God, so, I quit. Can you see my nipples through this shirt? <laughs> oh, you have goals, you have dreams. I don't have a dream. Don't I seem like somebody who should be doing something really cool? You know, I just always pictured myself doing something... something. Oh, it's just, I need something that's more than a job. I need something I really care about. And that's on top of the year-end bonus structure you mentioned earlier? Dream, dream. dream. Look, Al, Al. I'm not playing hardball here, okay? This is not a negotiation. This is a, this is a rejection. No, 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 stop saying no, stop saying numbers. I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. You've got the wrong guy. I'll see you Monday. Yeah. Nina Bookbinder is here to see you. Oh, okay, send her in. Worst case scenario, say you never feel like a father. Mm -hmm. Say your son never feels connected to you as one. Say all of his relationships are affected by this. Do you have a point? You know you'd think I would. He is cursed. What? Oh, I cursed it. 
So now bad things will happen to he who spends it. That's all right. I'll take it. Bad things happen to me anyway. This way I can break him up with a movie. I can't remember the last time I got a girl to take care of my monkey. <laughs> Can I help you? Uh, we're kind of having an emergency and we were looking for something. A monkey. Yes, have you seen any? Uh, aren't we kind of in the middle of something here? Yes, but these women are very hot and they need our help. And they're very hot. Oh, Danielle, I wasn't expecting the machine. <laughs> Give me a call when you get a chance. Bye-bye. Oh, God. What was with the dishes? Oh, uh, I want her to think I might be in a restaurant. You know? I might have some kind of life, like I haven't been sitting around here honing for the last two hours. But you don't think that makes me seem a little... Desperate, needy, pathetic? Ah, you obviously saw my personal ad. I'm not going to talk to her. She obviously got my message and is choosing not to call me. Now I'm needy and snubbed. God, I miss just being needy. Hello? Hello? Why don't you just call her? I can't call her. I left the message. I have some pride. Do you? No. <laughs> Anybody who's not an ex-husband or a lesbian life partner, out you go. Let me ask you, do you have to be Carol's lesbian life partner? God, I can't believe one of us actually has one of these. I know. I still am one of these. Well, the tough thing is she really wants to have sex with me. Crazy bitch.